when you are sleeping and you are not thinking and you are not seeing anything god already prepared a partner for you which the lord god really prepared that's why in the evangelical christian community we always called it god's will I, Rosalind, take you this same to be my husband, to have and to hold from this day. For better, for worse, to love, to cherish, and to honor till death do us part. God saw the need of a man who will be his partner forever. In the garden, God taught us great purpose of marriage, that marriage relationship should be an exclusive marriage. For the Lord said, man will leave his father and mother, and the woman leaves her home, and they shall go to where and the two will become as one. Second, God taught us that it would be an intimate relationship because for God, one plus one is equals one. I promise to love you unconditionally to support you in your goals, to honor and respect you, to laugh with you, to cry with you, and to be there for you as long as we both live. I will always be kind, patient, and forgiving, but most of all, I promise to be a true and loyal friend to you. Eagerly anticipate the chance to grow together, getting to know the woman you will become, and falling in love a little more every day. I promise to love and cherish you through whatever life may bring us. I love you, my honey. Too.